What's up, y'all? It's Solo. We got my Mahonia here. If y'all saw my update last season, this thing put on a whole bunch of flowers. And the bees love them. Mostly the honeybees. Interestingly, uh, this thing flowered way before my mason bees usually do. And the mason bees didn't get too much action. Maybe some of the males got a visit with them. But the females that actually collect the pollen, I don't think got any of these. But definitely it looks like something definitely did because we have berries all over this thing and these berries are great because i can take them and make a jam out of them i have to take the berries and boil them down and then crush the liquid out of them while keeping uh, the seeds separate using like a cheesecloth for example and what that does is it gives me like a jam and it tastes really good it kind of tastes like a cranberry now this plant's no called the organ grape. That's another name for leather, leather leaf mahonia. And you can see how it got its name. They look kind of like grapes. And uh, I don't, we don't live in Oregon here, this is Georgia, but I did buy them from, I think, another state. But they also grow here native in Georgia, so its name is a little misleading. It grows in a lot of places. But I have two of them. I actually moved them apart just last year, they were growing side by side, and they, uh, I don't think they had enough space. So I separated them and gave them each their own area to grow in. And I think they're really happy now. I think they're really happy. So I'm looking forward to uh, the next few years, see how big they get now that they have their own space to grow in. And can't wait to get some tasty berries, if I can beat the birds to it. Those damn birds tend to get to them the day of, and you better be on top of your game if you want to beat the birds to the berries. Anyway, I'll show y'all the other one. Give me a minute. Here is that other leather leaf mahonia, and this thing has gotten a lot bigger. I think that's because. I did not transplant this one. This one stayed in the ground, the other one moved. So this one got the chance to really start growing big. You can see it's practically as tall as me. And it's probably going to get a lot taller. I think they can get upwards of like about 10 feet tall. So anyway, I'm really looking forward to seeing these berries come out. Hopefully I can beat the birds to them. The bees have already visited all of them. Now it's just a whole bunch of uh, berries for them. This thing has gotten big. I think it really wanted its own space because it was growing right next to it. 